starting small and then work up to something bigger. Um, so, and by the way, I have to just reset uh, the monitors because the monitors are deciding to uh, <laughs> go into eco mode, which turns them off. Um, so you need to start small and work your way up. And that means an hour a day, two hours a day, three hours a day. You know, you're not going to be able to do that right off the start. But week one, you might get five hours in. Week two, it might be 10 hours. Week three, it might be four hours. Uh, 15 hours week four it might be 20 hours and you've got to start small and you've got to build up uh, what happens for a lot of people is they start with 20 hours a week okay and by the time to get to week four they are so utterly burnt out they've made no money because there's this idea that you start you start a side hustle and the money will just flow in and do you think that if it was that easy everybody would be doing it and it maybe feels like everybody's doing it but i'll tell you most people are not most people start something i mean we you know on the property sourcing training we can see we can log into the back end and we can actually see who's actually carried out the training as a percentage you know 80 percent 10 percent and who it isn't and there's a lot of people who they buy it they start gung-ho and then you know it, it peters out and they're not getting through to the end of the course they're not doing a training or they'll get certain bits and they don't finish the course and and then the other side of it is we get a lot of people who will buy a website out of all those people that buy the website when it comes to renewing that website in 12 months how many of those do you think actually renew their website it's a very low percentage we're talking 20 to 25 percent of people who create property sourcing websites never renew it right because they, they've given up already that's not what a side hustle is. You start small, you work up, you get serious about it, and you, you go and you create this thing that's going to replace your income. You can't start thinking, oh, I'm going to replace my income. I'm only going to work five hours um, uh, uh, a week for the next 52 weeks. Like, no one starts a business, as, so let me rephrase that. Nobody starts a successful business in that way and ends up in 12 months time multi-millionaires it just doesn't work you've got to start small and you've got to work up